Hi guys, welcome to Java Express channel. Today I'm going to discuss how to install Java software in Windows operating system. Okay, so before going to start, whether the software is installed or not, if you want to verify, just type here command prompt here. Just you can open the command prompt. If you want to check just Java hyphen hyphen version. Okay, just if you use, you will get a kind of an exception. Java is not recognized as a internal or external command. That means Java software is not available in your system. Now I will be help you how to install your Java software. Let me close the command prompt and let me open a Google Chrome here. Okay, now what I can do in the Google type JDK 8 download here. If you want to install the Java software. Now, just you can use Java SE8 standard edition. Click on here. Now, you want to install the Windows operating system. If you want the Linux, yes, you can use the Linux operating system. Or if you need a Mac, Mac. If you want to use the Windows, you can Windows, you can use it. Let me click this software. Now, it will be asked to accept the agreement and click download. If you want to download the Java software, you need to register, you need to create a Oracle account. It's a free account. Let me create a account here. Okay. Now here, let me give email ID. Let me create myself. Okay. This is our email ID. This is the official email ID guys. Let me register and let me provide the password. And even you can also uh, use your own password. Okay. And here, let me give a first name or last name. Let me give Java Express. Okay, let me choose the same name and job title. If you don't have anything, just you can use as a software engineer. Just you can provide a mobile number also. No issues. Triple five nine two nine two eight five and company name. If you don't know anything, just you can use as a NA here. If you want, you can provide a Hyderabad and let me provide some kind of a state. Just you can use as a, anything Telangana, postal code, some postal code I'm giving. Just you can provide, if you don't know anything, just you can make it as any ways, no issues, okay? And click create account. If any issue, it will be throw an exception. Uh, hope it is a creating, okay? Now, if you want to download the Java software, okay? It needs to, okay? Uh, it needs to verify your email address. Now, let me open my email address here. So it needs to verify your Gmail account. Let me click somewhere. Yes, I received a Oracle. Verify your email address. Let me click here. So once it is the installation completed, click on continue here. Okay, that means your email ID is ready. Now again, just go to here. Now here you can use your credentials here. Now let me use the credentials here. Just I created an account, even I verified with your email. After that, you can able to download your JDK software. Now, please have a look. Now it needs to download your JDK 8. Now are you able to see guys? Now the JDK 8 is downloading now. So you need to create a account also. Now let me open. It is take, based on your internet connection, it is taking that time. Let it be. Yes, software is downloaded here. Let me open show in folder. Okay. Now here, this is my Java software. Previously I downloaded. Let me remove the old one and just right click and open. Now software installation is very easy. Now click yes. <clears throat> and it needs to verifying. I think some software is installing. Yes. Now see software is installing. Click on the next, click on the next. Let me minimize everything. Yes. The software is installing here. Not able to open. Yeah. When I open back, uh, back. Okay. Now, here still it is in progress. It is asking to install a JRE change in license terms. Click on OK here. Then it is asking to install JRE also. Whenever you are insta installing JDK, Java software, two softwares will be installed. One for the JDK, another for the JRE also. Click on the next. 
and installing the Java. Okay, three billion devices running this product basically. Java. Okay, it's a volatile product. Let it be run. Once this software is installed, you can able to see inside your C drive. Still, software is installing is happening here. Keep it here. Now, open program files. Here, you are able to see there is a Java software is installed here. Just open. And here, you are able to see when you install the Java software, JDK and JRE. Both softwares are installing. Once this installation is completed, and you need to see installation is completed here. Click close here. Now Java software is installed. Now, if you open your command prompt CMD, you can use the shortcut Windows or type CMD here. And you can use again Java hyphen version. Still, you will get an okay. Now are you able to see when I use Java 8? Even uh, if you are installing automatically your Java path is okay. Uh, it, I can see it is placed automatically. Now, sometimes whenever you are using the Java version, you cannot able to see this kind of version also. To overcome this issue, see, now if I want to compare Java C, when you type and enter, are you able to see Java C is not recognized as the internal or external command. Now, currently in my system, Java version is 1.8. If you want to run any Java program, you need to use Java C compiler. So you need to give a input to the system. Where is your binary files? Now open JDK and click bin folder. Now just copy this particular path. Just you can click on this particular URL. Now you can able to get your link copy. And here there is here two ways you can set the path. Here type here to search are able to see. Here just you can type edit, okay, uh, system environment variables. Are you able to see edit system environment variables? Click on here. And you can able to see environment variables. Click on here. And here you can able to see in the bottom, there is an option called new. Here I want to set the Java path, okay. It is a standard way whenever you're installing, we need to use as a Java home and you need to paste it here. Now, here I'm removing slash bin. This is the software you are keeping here till the root directory of our JDK. Okay. And this Java home, you need to convey in the path. Are you able to see in this path? Click edit option here. It just you can double click on here. Just you can use, I am navigating to here and just you can type Java underscore home and you ampersand and slash and bin here. This is the way standard way you need to kept your Java path here. Once this step is completed, click OK, OK, OK and close. I'm closing everything I'm closing now. Okay. Now here I'm opening again command prompt here. Click on command prompt here. Here now just verify Java hyphen version. If you want, let me increase the font size here. Uh, property, you can use the font. Let me use 24. And here, Java C. Just I'm typing is Java C. Are you able to see? When I use the Java C, it is saying that some possible options it is displaying for you. That means your Java software is installed. Now you can able to run any Java application also using JDK. Okay. So these are the steps to install your Java program. Even we created some kind of a interview series uh, where you can go for just open here, YouTube here. I can show you that where is our Java Express channel. Just you can type Java Express here. Java Express. Here, if you are good to installation, here we created a playlist for you guys. Java interview questions. Just click on here. You can, if you are a beginner, if you are a fresher, just you can go through from day one onwards. Interview questions. Okay. I will be upload the video here itself. Remaining all questions, all possible interview questions in the interview. Everything I will be upload here. Thank you for watching us. Subscribe our channel. We'll catch up in the next session. Thank you.